Hello all, in this video we will discuss how to use various Omron sensors using Omron's Arduino evaluation board. Step 1 Hardware Components So for this we will be needing uh, various components which are as follows. Omron's Arduino evaluation board, Arduino MKR microcontroller, thermal sensor, D60 and its harness, harness 01, uh, Omron's differential pressure sensor and its harness 02, Omron's flow sensor and its harness harness 03, Omron's light conversion sensor and its harness harness 04, Omron's air quality sensor and its harness harness 05. Let's move on to step 2 which is hardware setup. First we need to solder the eval board in order to connect it to the Arduino board. So we'll connect the eval board to Arduino board like this and then we'll connect the USB cable to the Arduino board and then we'll connect the Omron's harness to the Omron's eval board which would be like this. keep in mind pressure sensor and flow sensor use the same connector so only one of them can be connected at the instant. Step 3 set up Arduino download Arduino ID from this website the details for setup is mentioned in the tutorial. Step 4 setting up the Arduino driver so run the Arduino ID on your PC and then once the ID is open connect the Arduino board to your PC via USB cable. After connecting the Arduino board to your PC, if your ID shows to install the package like you can see on my screen, then you need to install that package. Click on install and then install. So once the package installation is done, uh, you will have to set up the drivers for Arduino board. So click yes and install. So now the installation is completed. Please close it and now go to your device manager. Please see the COM port. So as you can see, the COM port in my laptop is COM34. Step 5. Download sample code. Sample code for evaluating sensors is available on GitHub on this link. Click here to download zip file. And you can see here in your downloads folder. Step 6. Sample code setup. Go to tools, board and then select the board type which is Arduino MKR Wi-Fi 1010. Go to tools and then to port and com port. Go to sketch, include library, add zip library and then go to the download folder and open the file. Go to file and then examples and then the file name was B5WD6FD60 and click on that. So it will open up the code and the next thing is to do compilation. Click here. Once the code is compiled, please see this message. We need to upload it to the Arduino. So click here. So once the code is uploaded, you will see this message. Step 7. Get data. Go to tools. Select serial monitor and then you will see the output window. Step 8. Observation. So as you can see the first output is B5WLB that is the light converged sensor. So if you put your finger very close to the sensor you will see the reading is almost zero. And if I move my finger a little farther you will see the voltage level increasing. The maximum voltage is around 2 volts. If I go further it will start to reduce as you can see. The next one is thermal sensor. That is D6001. Right now the room temperature is around 23 degrees Celsius. But if I move my hand closer to the sensor, you will see the change in the temperature around 26. And if I move hand again, you will see the temperature again as 23. The next sensor is D6FPH. That is the differential pressure sensor. Right now the reading is almost zero. So if I just blow in the sensor, you will see the change in the reading. So one thing you have to note here is that the connector of the differential pressure sensor and the flow sensor is the same. So right now the flow sensor reading is not correct. So I'm going to replace the uh, differential pressure sensor with the flow sensor. Right now the reading of the flow sensor is almost zero. So now I'll blow into the flow sensor. One thing to note here is that I have to blow in the direction of the uh, flow.
you will see a change in the flow and the last one is b5w ld that is the air quality sensor right now you can see the count as one and when i bring a cloth closer to the sensor you will see the count increasing like four and if i move it back it's one again so these are all the omron sensors which can be evaluated using arduino board